Hello my fellow handsome gentlemen, I'm Piotr Grotnik from Men's Improvement, the channel that's dedicated to make you look, feel, smell and be like the best possible version of yourself. Today's video is about hair and hairstyling, specifically about hairsprays. Hairsprays can be used to make your hairstyle sit in place for a longer period of time. Hairsprays are a good type of product for those people who want their hairstyle to stay in shape for a longer period of time or if it requires a lot of volume. And if your hair has tendencies to fly all over the place, hairsprays could be something for you. There's a lot of hairsprays out there on the market at very different price points. So in this video, I'm going to show you the difference between a cheap and average and expensive hairspray and how they perform. After that, I'm going to tell you my personal opinion about these three products at the three different price points and tell you which one I think you should go for. I'm going to start with the cheap priced hairspray. The cheap hairspray I used was this extra strong hold volume hairspray from Schwarzkopf. This small travel size bottle was $1.60 and a bigger bottle would cost you $3.20. When I applied this into my hair after applying a clay, I was expecting to get very dry or very sticky hair because of the price point of the product. But to my surprise, it wasn't actually that bad as I thought it would be. In fact, it was better than I expected. It kept my hair in shape as it should and its performance was actually very decent after nine hours of being in my hair. The result of how my hair looked after nine hours after using this in my hair was actually very surprising because it still kind of looked in shape. It felt a little sticky and a tad bit dry, but definitely not as much as I thought it would because of the price point of the product. Now let's look at the medium priced hairspray. The one I tried was this hard hold spray from ID Hair. I bought this 500ml bottle for $10.85, which is a very fair price point for how much of the product you're actually getting. I was a little bit disappointed when I tried this one. The hairspray didn't hold for as long as I wanted it to and it resulted in my hair having a lot of flyaway hairs all around it. My hair also felt a little bit drier than I wanted it to, so that was also a very big disappointment. My hair also fell flat after a few hours and therefore I needed to fix my hairstyle with using my hands and my fingers to put it back in place, which totally ruined the hairstyle after just a few minutes and didn't look as sharp as it did when I first applied the product. A solution could have been to apply even more of the product in the first place than I usually did. But that could potentially end it up with my hair feeling even more dry and maybe even stickier if I used more product than I did. And therefore, I will probably not repurchase this whenever it's empty. Or I might even give it away to someone. I don't know. It wasn't worth the $10.85 mark as I would have liked it to. Lastly, but certainly not least, I got the expensive hairspray. Here I got the luminous hairspray with medium hold and finish from Moroccan oil. I got this 330ml bottle for $30, which is actually a okay price in my opinion from a brand that is well known for giving men and women out there high quality products for their hair. When I applied this to my hair for the first time, it felt very good in my hair because it didn't make my hair dry or sticky or anything. It held my hair in position for around three to four hours, which was very surprising knowing that this is also only a medium hold compared to the cheaper alternative that I showed you that was extra strong hold. So after the first four hours, my hair fell a little bit flat, but I could easily just push my hair up back again with just a little push into my hair. It wasn't of course perfect as it was when I applied it, but it was a lot easier to fix than my hairstyle with the cheaper alternatives. After even more hours after the first application of the hairspray, I started to get a, a few fly away hairs. They were a little bit annoying, but with just a simple push back, I could easily have fixed them and the fix would have lasted for approximately half an hour and then I needed to push it even more and even further back in order to fix the flyaway hairs. But again, it's a medium hold and I didn't expect much stronger hold than the cheap alternative with the extreme hold, but my hair still felt more natural and healthier with using this compared to the cheap alternatives. And to my surprise, it was also very easy to wash out of my hair. So what I have found out with testing a cheap, average and expensive hairspray is that price and quality have a very close relationship. I must say that a surprising factor was that the cheaper 
hairspray was better in my opinion than the average and medium priced hairspray. But what I did expect was that the expensive hairspray was the best out of the bunch. In my opinion, you should go for the hair product that you can afford. I wouldn't recommend you ever buying a product that you can't afford just in order to look good. I think you should buy the products that you can afford and use them as, as best as you can and do your own research on how you can get the most out of the products that you're buying. I also would like to add that it helps a lot by using the products uh, yourself so you can get a better understanding of which products work or don't work for your hair. So in my opinion, you should try a, a few products just to see which product works for you. And I hope that this video helped you to form your own opinion about which price point of products could work for you. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already for more videos like this one and general videos for you to become the best looking and generally the best possible version of yourself. Also, don't forget to press the notification bell so you're notified every single time I make a new video for you guys to enjoy and learn from. Until the next video, smile more, it's free.